ligaments. All right, so for the triangular fibrocartilage complex, uh, there's a few ligaments that we want to support. Now, this is going to, obviously, kin tape will be used for more of a chronic condition. Uh, if you actually want to limit that motion or support it, you're going to use more of that strapping technique. So here we can use two pieces of kin tape. You can also use three if you really want to provide a little more feedback, but you technically only need two. And all you're doing here, um, you're trying to support three ligamentous structures. So obviously, or you're just trying to support the disc itself. Uh, you have your uh, ulnocarpal ulno ligament, and then you also have your radial ulnar ligament. So if you want to be, obviously the TFCC is right in here between your ulna and your carpal row. So you want to be approximating the radia and ulna, the radius and ulna, and then you also want to be um, approximating the ulna towards the carpal row. So when we're doing this, we're going to start on the palmar aspect of the hand. And we start where I think our eminence is. And when we come around, you're going to pronate for me. And we come all the way around here. And while you're doing this, you can also put pressure uh, directly on the pisiform as well. And then from the alternate angle, so we just started from here and then around. You can start on the medial side, relax there, of the TFCC. Come down a little lower if you want. And as he supinates, we're going to put tension that way. This is not going to provide a whole lot of support, but this is just more proprioceptive feedback so that when he is pronating and supinating, uh, he just feels a little more supportive taping technique there. But again, we're going to go into more of the strapping techniques, which would be far more supportive in nature. Okay?